Hi, I'm Dala and welcome to a very long awaited update video on the fast charging 400 kilowatt project at home. So this took way way longer than I expected this to take but I am very happy to report that I now have a grid connection and I'm actually sitting in my car right now which is charging at 40 kilowatts. And you might ask, well, that's not the 400 kilowatt, but uh, we will get there. So this project, like I mentioned, it started like two years ago. And I was thinking that, yeah, I will just order a grid connection and we will get started with the build and everything. And I ordered a grid connection and it took uh, one and a half years before the grid connection was in place. So I am quite disappointed in my electrical utility provider, but Oh well, it is here now, so I can use it and I can actually get started on this project. But like we just had power turn on like a few days ago, so this is a very new fresh grid connection. So I'm using the Kempower movable charger, so I'm now charging at uh, 40 kilowatts, which is the full 63 amps that this grid connection is providing. And the reason why I did not buy a larger grid connection is that uh, it's extremely expensive, like this one already cost I think it was like 6,500 euros to get this grid connection. And like if I wanted the absolute grid connection, I think I will pay very large into the like, uh, like five digits. Uh, like it's gonna be extremely expensive to get the uh, full grid connection that this chem power charger requires. So we're gonna be boosting with batteries, but now we're getting a bit ahead of ourselves. But I have the grid connection in place. We are able to charge here at the farm. And a lot of you also asked in the initial video, like, what is this place? Uh, so this is not my workshop. Uh, this is my parents-in-law's farm. They actually run a, a bed and breakfast here, uh, which is called Lillstugan. So this place is situated in Vöro, Finland. Uh, Vöro is, uh, as you might know, if you watch the recent Eurovision, you might uh, know that this place is very famous for uh, Kai. Uh, but yeah, uh, this is like a farm and it's located near a, a quite busy road. So that's my why I initially thought that uh, this place would be a very good place to put a fast charger because it's very close to the road. And also like the customers here that are taking in at the uh, Airbnb, that like they want to charge. I have actually installed, I have solar panels here on uh, this building and there's also uh, another building uh, down here that I also put solar panels on and I also put up these um, 22 kilowatt uh, AC chargers. Uh, I have two of these up that guests can use and they have been quite, getting quite the use uh, over the years now. So I thought that it would be quite kind of natural to kind of upgrade this uh, to become like a DC fast charger capable uh, location also. So that's kind of the reasoning behind all of this. And if you want uh, to uh, visit this place, like feel free, like uh, I will put links in the description to uh, what Lillstugan is and you can uh, check it out on booking.com or whatever place you use to uh, book your hotels. Like it's very nice. It's in the uh, Finnish uh, countryside and you can watch us uh, <laughs> work here at the farm. Uh, this farm is actually uh, being used. So that's kind of uh, like nice. Uh, lots of tourists uh, like to see uh, actual uh, farming uh, taking place. So that's something you can do or just like take in the beautiful uh, Finnish countryside. Wow, this turned kind of into an ad, but yeah, I really think that this is a, a very beautiful place and uh, it's nice nice for people to uh, experience it. So that is Lillstugan. Uh, but yeah, uh, back to my uh, quick charger plans. So like, okay, we can DC fast charge at 40 kilowatts. Like, nice, that's uh, better than the 22 kilowatt AC charging that we previously had. But now the real project starts. So now uh, it's time to actually lay the foundation uh, that is required uh, for the Kempower satellite system. And we're also going to be uh, installing like underground uh, DC cabling and just wiring everything in. So this is gonna take a while. Uh, we will start uh, in the autumn here with the groundworks. So I will be pushing out some uh, update videos, like how we are getting along with this uh, more permanent one. Uh, but yeah, Dala, you haven't still uh, explained how, how to get the power. Yeah, so that will install Kempower DC satellites that are capable of very high power. 
but we're also gonna be having to start uh, phase two of this which is to install more solar panels because the solar panels that are already on these two buildings here they are connected to a separate grid connection and they don't have batteries or anything so we will need to set up a secondary or like a tertiary like this is the third solar panel array here that will have batteries and this will enable us to boost the DC power like when the Kempower DC charger requires lots of energy we can then pull that from the batteries and inject it into the this grid connection this new one so that is how we will be getting the very large uh, power figures but this is a massive project and this is not something that I will have done in like just a uh, few months time this is a long-term project because we need to do the uh, underground cabling also to another uh, building here that will house the solar panels because this house is full so it just gets complicated really fast and, and um, expensive but this is gonna be really silly and really fun because like this is one of those why the heck would you want to do that because this is so expensive and I'm like why not this is like fun this is a very fun hobby and in the end it's gonna be like really useful infrastructure for people here like now the DC charging is free and I, I uh, or let's see how, how, how that works maybe I will need to become a, a CPO now in order to uh, have this <laughs> thing to work uh, maybe we'll make, make a series on how it is to, to be a CPO and set up payment uh, systems etc and all this fun stuff so yeah I really hope that you will um, watch this series uh, it's a bit different from my uh, normal content but uh, yeah it will be a uh, very very exciting stuff so yeah uh, thank you for uh, watching this real uh, quick update video and be sure to check out uh, Lille Stugan here uh, links in the description so yeah thank you Dull out.